Welcome to Knowledge Hub, please subscribe and hit the bell icon for more breaking updates. In the silent darkness of space, Voyager 2 continues its journey, a tiny messenger from Earth. Launched in 1977, it was sent to explore the outer planets, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Back then, there was no internet, and music played on vinyl records. Voyager 2, and its twin Voyager 1, are humanity's boldest steps into the unknown. Each carries a golden record, a greeting to any distant civilization that might find it. Voyager 2 gave us our first close-up views of the giant planets, revealing storms, rings, and mysteries we'd only imagined. After its planetary tour, it didn't stop. It kept going, heading into interstellar space. Powered by a nuclear battery, it still whispers faint signals across billions of miles, using the deep space network to stay in touch. Just when we thought its story was over, Voyager 2 surprised us again. It sent back a signal, an image from a place no one expected. This was not just any picture, but a snapshot from beyond the furthest planet. A postcard from the edge of interstellar space, stunning scientists and the world alike. Even after decades, Voyager 2 reminds us, the universe is full of surprises. How did Voyager 2 take a picture in 2025, decades after its cameras were shut down? Its imaging system was turned off in 1989 to save power for its long journey. For over 30 years, it traveled blind, relying on instruments that measured magnetic fields and cosmic rays. But a few engineers at NASA had a daring idea. Could they wake the camera just once? The challenge was immense. Ancient hardware, outdated software, and a two-day round trip for commands. After months of careful planning, a command was sent from Earth. For two days, the team waited anxiously. Then, a faint trickle of data arrived. Voyager 2 had responded. The camera had turned on for a brief moment, capturing a single, long exposure image. The data was slow to download, but as it came together, an image appeared. It wasn't high definition, grainy black and white, but it didn't matter. What it showed was something no one had ever seen, a view from interstellar space looking back at our distant home. Voyager 2 had delivered one last incredible surprise. What did the image show? It was a view looking back at our solar system from the outside. Imagine seeing a city's glow from miles away in the dark. This was that, on a cosmic scale. The picture revealed a faint, structured cloud of light, the edge of the Oort cloud. The Oort cloud, long theorized but never seen, is a vast sphere of icy comets surrounding our solar system. Voyager 2, after nearly 50 years, was close enough to capture its faint glow. The image showed the Oort cloud isn't just a uniform haze, it has structure, with filaments and voids shaped by gravity and passing stars. The brightness and complexity stunned scientists, it was denser and more organized than anyone expected. Theorists scrambled to explain the structure and glow. Was it sunlight reflecting off trillions of icy bodies? Or something else? For the public, the image was awe-inspiring. A tangible connection to the edge of our solar system. News outlets shared the grainy photo, explaining its profound significance. It redefined our sense of where the solar system ends. Voyager 2 had taken a picture of the wall of our cosmic house, from the outside. A new frontier, thousands of times farther than Neptune was revealed. Voyager 2's image made headlines worldwide, sparking wonder and excitement. At NASA's press conference, scientists were visibly moved as they unveiled the picture. The story trended instantly, shared by people everywhere. It wasn't just a science story, it was a human one, about endurance and seeing home from afar. Scientists called it the most important image since the pale blue dot, providing the first direct evidence of the Oort cloud structure. Classrooms, social media, and news outlets buzzed with awe and pride. The image became a symbol of hope and curiosity, inspiring new research and questions. Could other stars have similar structures? How do these boundaries shape planetary systems? Voyager 2's final photo handed the next generation a new cosmic puzzle to solve. To appreciate the image, consider Voyager 2's journey, over 14 billion miles from Earth. Light takes more than 22 hours to reach it, the scale is almost unimaginable. Voyager 2 used gravity assists from Jupiter, 
Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune to slingshot through the solar system. This rare planetary alignment made its grand tour possible. Along the way, it discovered new moons, rings, and storms, transforming distant points of light into real worlds. After Neptune, it began its interstellar mission, crossing the heliopause in 2018. Now it sends back data from the space between stars, measuring plasma and cosmic rays. Voyager 2 is our first true interstellar sentinel. Its discoveries have rewritten textbooks and expanded our horizons. And now, it's given us a glimpse of the solar system's edge. Voyager 2's image is more than a picture, it's proof the Oort cloud exists. For decades it was just a theory to explain comets, now, we have direct evidence. The image shows the Oort cloud as a structured, dynamic shell, not a uniform haze. Gravity from the Milky Way and passing stars may have shaped its filaments and voids. This discovery changes our understanding of how comets, and possibly life's building blocks, reach planets like Earth. If the Oort cloud is denser than we thought, it could affect how often these materials arrive. Studying it helps us understand the potential for life elsewhere in the galaxy. This was an unplanned discovery, born from ingenuity and persistence. Even our oldest explorers can make history. Voyager 2 inspires us to keep pushing boundaries and seeking answers. What does this mean for us? This single, grainy image gives us perspective. It reminds us our world is a tiny speck, enclosed in a vast bubble of ice and dust within the Milky Way. Yet, it highlights the preciousness of our home and the tenacity of life here. Voyager 2's discovery fuels our desire to explore further, its story is one of curiosity, engineering, and generations working together. The quest for knowledge is a baton passed on. As we look at the glowing frontier, we see a reflection of ourselves, a testament to our need to explore. The journey isn't over. In many ways, it's just begun. Keep looking up.